Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. So it looks like maybe something could be happening because as you can see in the background, Henry Carvel is at Warmer World. I don't know if he's there right now, so don't go and rush out if you're not in game. Actually, he's probably shut at this time if I'm not mistaken, but he has been to Warhammer World within the last day or maybe like today or something like that this was uh taken from darren latham um who actually works at games workshop if you don't know what he does he's like a, a miniature designer he was like the former um heavy metal painting person he's like he's just like a god when it comes to bloody painting you probably remember him because he actually used to have a um, a youtube channel where he did some fantastic bloody tutorials um and he's just posted this now over on his Instagram page, and everyone's going wild. I'm going wild, of course, because you know me, I've got like quite a, a bit of an obsession, let's say, with Henry Carville and his fandom um, in Warhammer 40,000. We know it's definitely Warhammer World because you can just actually see in the background all the display bits and uh, stuff like that. I think that's the Isfan bit just like behind them too, if I'm not mistaken. Now we know of course GW does this all the time. They like invite celebrities down. I think the last two people who were down were those pro wrestlers. I haven't watched wrestling since the days of, you know, Stone Cold beating on Vince McMahon every weekend. So their names escape me. But um, this is like, I would say like the uh, the big leagues, the premiership, let's say, to get someone like, a, you know, an A-list Hollywood actor down like Henry Carvel, get him round because we all know he's a fan. How many bloody videos have I put on the channel with his interviews, talking about like his favorite chapters of Salamander's Blood Angels. You know, he's talking about playing like certain parts and what he doesn't want to play and stuff like that. We all know he's a massive bloody fan of Warmer 40,000. Now, the question is, was he there solely on pleasure or was this business as well? Has he maybe gone there to discuss maybe a future project with Games Workshop? You know, maybe something that he would like to play. We know like this series like Eisenhorn out there. I know he actually talked about Eisenhorn himself and saying, you know, he doesn't really want to lock himself down. I've always said, give him Valdor. Look at that chin. That chin is just, it's just Valdor. Just put some golden armor on it and, you know, he's he, he's there to purge in the Emperor's name. Anyway, I thought I'd share this with you. Yes, it's not a big video. It's not a long video, but there it is. Confirmation that Henry Carvel has gone to the mecca of the 40k fandom. I was actually there the other day. Why couldn't I bump into him? The, imagine if I bumped into him the other day. I probably want to have let go of his leg. I'd be like, Henry, please, please, please play Rogue Dawn. Henry, please, we need you. We need you back in 40k. Um, but yeah, awesome to see Henry at Warmer World. Um, I'm sure all the staff at Warmer World were absolutely losing their mind. Um, again, I would be. Um, and hopefully, hopefully, fingers crossed, um, we get something Warhammer 40k-ish um, happening with Henry. Maybe, you know, Horus Heresy-wise, um, not too long in the future because I will literally sell my soul for that. Right, enough waffling. Thank you for coming. Thank you for watching. Um, see you now. If you've got any thoughts and feedback, post it down below if you want and we'll have a little talk down there. See you and bye-bye.